Welcome back to my card cabinet, everyone. My name is Keelan, and in today's video, we're opening up two booster boxes of Battles of Legend Terminal Revenge. Um, I wanted to do this last week, but there was none uh, available at my locals until later in the week, and by then I already had a video made, so... Uh, it's here now, and honestly, I am glad that I waited, just because... Well, if you guys haven't seen, um, let's see, do I still have the tab pulled up? Yes, I do. Uh, I just need to change one or two things. So, the uh, biggest card you can pull from here, the, the controversial one of this set, Dragon Master Magia. It's only available in quarter century secret rare, and it is $743 as of this uh, video. Granted, that's what people are selling it at, but market price is $538.86. That's still insane. So I can't tell if this is because of just the rarity or because it's an actually good card. If anyone could clarify that for me, that'd be great. So yeah, uh, I have two boost boxes. I'll go ahead and open these up, mix them up, and then set them out. And then let's get to hunting. Okay, we're back. So let's get to opening. I since we have 48 packs to go through, I don't think I'll be doing any packets. So, let's see what we got. Um, also, if the voice quality sounds a bit different, uh, the flooring in my room, which is where I record, is getting changed. So, there's not as much uh, material to muffle the echo. I apologize for that. It probably is going to get worse. I'll see what I can do about it. Alright, so let's see. We start off with Void Recognition. We have Frozen Domain of the Ice Barrier and an Archfiend's Advent to start us off, which will beast Ulti Kenahawk and Spiritual Beast Tamer Winda. This is the first time I pretty much will be experiencing these cards as I have not opened anything from this set as of late. So, sorry about that. Just wanted to get something out of the way. Okay. Maybe I should do the pack trick. Let's go a few. Frozen, frozen Domain again. Jeez. Gen X Ally Birdman. And Georgia Swordsman of the Ice Barrier. Very nice. In front of our party. A, a piety, not party. And Spirit Converter. Okay, maybe I should do Patrick. Alright. Okay, let's see what we got. We have Spiritual Beast Tamer, Winda, Scrap Goblin. We have Pillar of the Future, Cyanos. Toy Tank and a Branded Fusion. It's probably not too bad, but still. It's another reprint, guys. <laughs> uh, oh, actually, important question. So I'll make a poll of this too. Uh, so I have recently hit 150 subscribers, which thank you everyone for, to, for subscribing to the channel. Um, my question is, would you be interested in seeing something from Pokemon, Yu-Gi-Oh, or maybe another lightsaber opening? or something else open down the channel. Let me know down in the comments and when I put up the poll. So yeah, I have a I have a couple of ideas what I want to do, but I do want to hear what you guys are interested in seeing. So, Repair Genic Controller. Thank you for everyone for uh, subscribing and uh, watching these videos. It really means a lot, so thank you. We have Infernoid. Onun Onuku, I don't know, Infernoid Atondo, White Circle Reef, we have a Mirror Match, and a, ooh, okay, not a bad one, a Curry Card, Div Incarnate, this is one of the few good secret rares, um, it also is a reprint, so yeah, there's already a, a better rarity of it out there. <sighs> Power of the Elements. I remember that. Gen X Ally Duradark. We have Infernoid again. Toy Soldier. A elect an Electro Beast Anoin. And Gigantic Sprite. I think it's another good one. Could be wrong on that. But I think it is. We're all we're looking for Phantom View Bell, as that is the best one, or best secret rare out of the bunch. So hopefully we pull it. TB, the World Chalice Justicar. Bellion, the Searing Dread. You guys see it? We have 
a quarter century in here. We only have Syrian Dragon Gen X controller. We have Mirror Match. We're looking for a quarter or for a fusion monster. Come on. It's purple. It's fusion. It's a fusion. It's a fusion. Infernoid Evil. Ah. Well, we didn't pull it, but this is still, <laughs> it's a pretty good, it's pretty cool. Kind of, I hope. <laughs> uh, let's see, where do you rank? You're on the lower end. Uh, Infernoid Evil. Yeah. Yeah. Well, still. Considering how difficult it is, okay, it's not difficult, but it is frustrating to try and pull one all the same, so I can't really complain too much. We at least pulled one, so maybe we can pull a second one. I don't know, but right now, let's look for uh, Ubel. We have Synchro Panic, we have a bunch of Beast Bodies, and an Arms of Gen X Return Zero. Dalian and Sprite. Okay. What we got? We have a toy box. We have Earthbound Root Resonance and Georgius again. Okay. <laughs> I really thought it was just uh, Ubel and um, the Tool Beast Inheritance. Uh, Dragon Master that were fusion uh, monsters that could be QCRs. Apparently. I still works it well. As right below uh, Ubel on TCG Player, there's another uh, quarter century secret rare, which is um, Void Man. Okay, it is Lubellion, right? It's Lubellion? Lubellion, yeah, the Syrian Dragon. So, obviously, my hands don't work as well as they should. <laughs> oh well. There'll be, there'll be other chances. Alright. Shining Star. Dr I, rem I remember seeing this as QCR. This is a beautiful looking card, I must say. All right. Let's see. Hopefully we do pull, pull a U-Bell. Come on. Life hack. Void Breach. We have Ice Jade Ren. Agarine? I'm not sure. Blazing Cartesia again. This is what I say about reprints. This card has been reprinted multiple times. Like, I think this first came out in... Ah, oh, man, I can't remember. It's a collector rare set. But I'm pretty sure this first came out then, and then it became a star. It was also a Starlight Rare at another point, and now it's an Ultra Rare again, and I think more than likely it's a QCR in here. I say more than likely because there's a decent chance, but at the same time, I don't see it on the list here. Snatch Deal. Okay, that's not, that's not a bad one. So it's just, oh, man. I remember, I think this was an issue because people kept on bringing up on how, um, let's see, we have Lancia, Ancestral Dragon of the Ice Mountain, which is actually one of the better QCRs if you got it. Um, people were frustrated that so many uh, cards were, what's the right word, uh, expensive because they weren't being reprinted as much. And so therefore, that was the term, that was Konami thinking, oh, we can uh, start reprinting this. Red Lotus King, Flame Crime, F Flame Crime, F Flame Crime, and thus they just started to start reprinting uh, cards, thus lowering the value but making it more accessible to people. And while I can respect that, at the same time, it's rather frustrating. So we have Grand Goy Gon, the Dust Dragon. I'm just gonna say that the Dust Dragon. Okay. <sighs> so, I mean, that's not. It's not a bad idea, but at the same time, it does diminish the value of other cards. So it's just, I it guess, it's a give and take for Armored Utopic Ray Lancer. So, mm, I don't know how to feel about it. No, obviously, I know how to feel about it. I don't, I don't like it, but I understand it. Faster Ancient Gear Dragon. That's kind of cool. Don't know if that one's a rear print, because that sounds familiar. I know there's Ancient Gear Golem, but that was many sets ago. I can't remember which one in particular. Wonky Quartet and Infernoid Decatron. Okay. Let's see. Okay, come on. We have 
have a bunch of beast bodies, gathering light, and a ritual beast ulti re ratari I think. Alright. Up next, Toy Box, Electro Blaster, and Sky Striker Ace as Azalea Temperance, I think. I think it's Azalea. Alright, well. Okay. We have Division, Guard Dog, and Ice Jade, Gimmer, Agrigan, I think. Frozen, Domain of the Ice Barrier, Earthbound Resonance. We have the End of Anubis. I think it's a decent secret rare. I could be wrong on that. Okay. And I'm still frustrated by that. We got spooked so hard by Infernoid of Evil. Or Infernoid Evil. Spiritual Beast Tamer Lara. Uh, she's actually one of the better quarter century secret rares. If only. If Mirror Jade the Ice Blade Dragon. I think I last remember like this was a Starlight Rare at one point. That was several sets ago, but even still, now it's reprinted. I don't know if it was reprinted before this, but if so, then that's just another one onto the pile. Inferno Infernoid? Infernoid Hamadic. Joyous. Oh black guidings. Uh Okay. Toy Box, Void Breach, Full Armored again. That's quite unfortunate. You never want to see. There's so many secret rares in here, and you really don't want to see Sparks just yet. Especially since we haven't pulled the best one yet. Electrode, Division, Infernoid, Paramus, Permius. Permius, I think. Alright. Next, we have our Genex Nogin, White Circle Reef, Oil. For those who are old enough, this makes me think of um, John Tron's Anyone can purchase anything with the right amount of oil. He just squeezes him and flies it. Uh, what little I have seen of John Tron, it seems like he's a pretty funny guy. Let me know. I, that could age poorly, but. Uh, I. I enjoyed what uh, what few clips I have seen. Of him. All right, let's see. We have Sengen, Seng Sengenjin, Sengenjin. Okay, we have Arbitration of White and Synchro Creed. Nice. All right, come on, where's the U Bell? Where is the U Bell? Argenix, Toy Tank. We have Infernite Decatron. Okay, Decatron. Uh, no, it's Megatron. Don't you know? <laughs> okay. We have Guard Dog, White Circle Reef, and Proxy F Magician. By little. We're running out of chances to pull you bell. Come on. Electro Beast of oh, Catching, Gathering Lights. We have Void Imagination. Great. Another double up. Alright. Almost on to the last stack. Life hack. Gathering light. Ace spade speculation. We just had to raise our hopes. Okay. This will be the last stack. Hopefully we'll pull something. That the Legendary Exodia Incarnate. Okay, he may not be the most pricey, but I really wanted to pull this guy. I think he's dope as hell, and it's just, yeah, I, I think he's awesome. So, we at least pulled a cool card. Maybe not the best card, but a cool card. So, Guard Dog, Division, Mirror Mage of the Ice Barrier. All right. Probably not. We probably can't pull another one, but it would be cool if we did. Ritual Beast, or the double Diviner of the Herald. Only, I wish you were in 4th century. 
would be pretty good in quarter century. No, they wouldn't. All right, Toy Soldier, Electro Blaster, Shining Star Dragon. And dang it, we're doubling up. Come on, where's you, Bell? Where's you, Bell? We've gone through almost two boxes worth and haven't pulled them. We have Ritual Beasts, Ulti, Guy Pelio. Why? Why? Okay. Our Genex Turing, Genex Courier, and Tri Brigade Mer Courier. Okay. Okay, come on, come on, come on. We have Infernoid. 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 Come on. Not looking for you guys. Looking for a ghost. Bunch of beast bodies and Ebon's son. Alright, well, at least we got something different. Down to the last few packs. We have Arms of Gen X. Dang it, another. Another. Sorry, words. I said it earlier. We pulled that one already. A Spade Speculation. Three packs. Come on, come on, come on. Arbitration of White and Ice Jade Gamer. Box, Electro Beast, Ice. Oh my gosh, that's awful. All right, this is our last pack. Our last chance. Can we do it? Can we pull him? We have Sprite Gamma Burst, Sprite Red, Synchro Panic, Pillar of the Future, Cyanos, Cyan and Wing Karibo Level 6. This was just a game of teasing, wasn't it? Well, I guess that's it for this week. Um, let me know what you're interested in seeing for the 150 uh, subscriber special. Do you want to see me try and go for the Dragon Master Magia? Do you want to see this set open to you in general? If so, let me know down in the comments and like the video. That will definitely help. But until then, my card cabinet is closed. I'll see you all next time.